Our next task is to enter a position into the VHF. Now ideally, the VHF would be connected permanently to a GPS, so that if at any time you were to need to press the red distress button, your position would automatically be sent. If you don't have a GPS, you need to enter your position at regular intervals. To do that, you press menu, and then select, if it's not already on that option, position input. Press enter to select. It takes you to the latitude page. Use the arrows to enter the number. In this case, five for 50. Press the channel button to go to the right, and the channel button again. If you go too far, you can come back with a 16 button. In this case, we want to enter 23. Decimal, three, seven, zero. Check that the north and south is correct. Press enter to confirm. Now we're on to longitude. It asks you to do it as a three digit. So the first one will need to be zero in this case, because we want to enter five degrees. Moving along, 33 degrees, 2, 0, 0. Again, checking the east and west, I'm happy with west. Press enter. It asks for the current time. In this case, it's going to be in 24 hour clock, 8. One. and we press enter confirm. That takes us back to the menu screen, press clear to go to the home screen. If it's all worked correctly, your position and time should be displayed correctly.